What's up guys, Mutt Viles here, and as you guys see, we got our top three right here. Saquon finally making another top three. I think it was in there though last time, but we got ourselves for our opponent, Drew Brees, Ray Lewis, and Kyle Fuller. By the looks of it, he grinded out both his freaking, uh, both the stuff out. As right now, we're going to jump right into the game. First play, my opponent's in the pocket looking around, playing against the Patriots, getting himself a nice short pass for a first down. Actually, now it'll be second down. Second down and six, my opponent's in the pocket looking, throwing, it's going to be caught. By Franco Harris for a first down. Guys, so far though, as you guys saw in the beginning of the video, we got ourselves a new intro that I'm going with. Shout out to my brother. He's the one that freaking made the intro for me. So I'm going to leave a link to his Twitch in the description below if you guys want to go check him out. He plays a bunch of random games. The most recent one that he streamed was uh, Apex Legends. So if you guys want to check him out. I'll leave his link to his Twitch in the description below. I'll also leave a link to his Twitter so, so you guys know whenever he goes live. As you guys see right here, though, fourth and nine. Defense playing dominantly as we're going to get the ball back. As we get a pitch to Saquon Barkley. He's going to get a nice spin and get down for a couple of yards. Also, guys, I kind of have now what I'm going to do, though, with the rest of this week, what I plan on doing. And as also, if you guys didn't see what happened or – um. The content update recently as Deion Sanders gets a nice end around and he is gone for a touchdown to make it 7 to nothing. Um, They said on, what was it? They said today in their live stream that there's going to be Ultimate Legends every day this week. One today, tomorrow, Wednesday, and Thursday. There'll be none Friday because that's when Season 5 comes out. for uh, Or Series 5 for uh, Madden. So we're going to get ready for that as we get a nice hit right there. But hangs on to the ball. Um, also, what we're going to be doing is that as we get a nice interception right here by Deion Sanders, and Deion's going to force this man to quit. He's out of here. So we're going to hop right into game number two. As of right now, we are once again on the road. This time we're playing against some kid in the most fierce. He's got Derwin James, Ricky Williams, and Ray Lewis as well. This kid, I don't know why, though, I had a little bit of a harder time, but we'll see what happens as we're playing in the Giants stadium. As we're starting with the ball. But as I was saying, we have the Ultimate Legends like today. Kevin Green came out. So there's no new promo that came out today. But it's just going to be a 97 overall. Kevin Green. Pretty decent card if you put him on the line. Because he's not that fast with 86 speed. But with 95s galore as Randy Moss gets a nice catch. 95 pluses in like block shed, uh, power move, finesse move. He should be a good card. With cans up, though, he'll be up to a 91 speed. But as I was saying, though, we also have, they announced, we have, um, what the heck was it? Screw it. I just had it in my head. As we get a nice pass right there, going for it on fourth and two for a touchdown. Oh, house rules. That was it. I'm sorry. Um, house rules does come out tomorrow. So I am definitely going to grind that out and try to get the rewards day one like I did last week. And I will show you guys what you get. It's going to be another six in a row, but we don't know what it's going to be, though. We don't know if it's going to be rushing, if it's going to be anything to do with interceptions, sacks. Just keep in mind, though, if it's going to be sacks, just expect a lot of blitzes. Just expect a lot of them. But anyway, this kid gets a nice run on fourth and three with Ricky Williams to get himself a first down in the red zone. But that's what I'm going to do tomorrow. If it also comes out around then, I will post the... House rules rewards with the um, with weekendly rewards. As right now is third down and four. My opponent's having a hard time getting in, but he's gonna get in right here, just powering through my guys to make it a seven to six game. Because my man butchers the extra point. And honestly, after that though, I thought he was just gonna be mad and get off his game. But so far though, he stood on his game well. But as I was saying, that is definitely though what's gonna be going on though for tomorrow, Wednesday. I'm probably going to post another gameplay. And then we'll see what goes on though with Thursday. But as you guys see right now, that we are in the red zone right now on the 17-yard line. Saquon Barkley making three men missed. And that's it. He's in. That's going to make it 14-6. to six. Easy freaking touchdown for Saquon once again to make it 14-6. to six. To be honest though, guys, this game though, like I said, as I over-pursued it right there, Ryan Shazier. This game though... We did have a little bit of a hard time, though, I felt like. Because he just kept running stretch. And I don't know what it is. I was like, some plays, though, I did good on it. Some plays, I didn't. 
as it's second and three right now. My man's going to roll out to the left, to the right, actually, with Patrick Mahomes. And I didn't even bother trying to play that on his playmaker for a first down. I didn't even bother going to cover him. So he's going to hand it up back to Ricky Williams. Big hit by Brian Erlacher, but can't force the fumble. That's something I don't get, though. Why can't we get those fumbles right there? But look at that. Dion even moved for a second right before, if you go back and watch it, I was not on Dion. I went on Dion because he stopped running. I don't know why he stopped, but it's whatever. First and goal at the five. My opponent's going to rush it in with Ricky Williams to make it a 14 to 13 game. This time he gets the extra point. But you're about to see right now. When it came to that uh, that mess up on the field goal by him, yeah, I was honestly laughing about it. I just got my mouth shut because Dion's going to fumble the ball with 110 left in the first half. And my opponent's just doing whatever he wants. And right now, it's second and one. He's going to hand it off to Ricky Williams once again. Nice move by him. And he's going to get down on the 15-yard line. So first down 10. We're just trying to do what we can to keep him off the board. But add to this play right here, he's just going to go take three. As my opponent gets pushed out of bounds. From the five, it's going to be about a 25-yard field goal to make it 14-16 to 16 at the half. And he gets ball. So I'm sitting here saying to myself, yo, we need to make a play on defense. We need to do something right now. But with him right now, with Ricky, he is just pounding and pounding. As right there, I believe, is like the only time we stopped him. As you guys saw for a second, he already has over 100 yards rushing with two touchdowns. I don't know how the heck that we're supposed to get through this right now. As he's just going to dump it off to the flats once again. That's another thing that gets on my nerves. Why do everyone have to do that? Why does everyone have to do that? It's so annoying. But right over the middle, Jad Tatum making an athletic play to separate the ball. As right now, his second down and 10. My opponent trying to do what he can with Ricky. His third down and eight. He's going to hand it back off to him again. Not going anywhere this time. We're start, finally starting to stop him. Fourth and seven in the pocket. You guys can see right now, though, right over the middle. That receiver is open. But I got lucky and got there with Allen Page to make it first down and 10. Our ball in the pocket. We're just getting sacked immediately by LT. Second 17, we're going to give it back to Barkley. Making a man miss. Try to make another man miss, but he's right on top of me. 1.14 to go. Third and 10. My opponent, I know we're in the pocket right there, but Randy Moss once again making a play. First down 10. With under a minute to go, Ricky Williams getting down at the 8-yard line. It's second and 5. We're going back up with Barkley, trying to do something, but we cannot get off. So it will be third down and 9 in the pocket, looking I see it already. You see it as well. Squares open. Randy Moss once again with four seconds to go in the half. As you know, the third quarter, it'll be 21 to 16. But my opponent gets the ball back, so he has a shot as we're starting the fourth quarter right now. It's right there. We're going to knock the ball out. Second down and 10. He's in the pocket. He's looking. Rolling out to the right. Throwing over. Caught. He's going to be down for an eight-yard gain. It'll be third and two. He's going to hand it back all to Ricky Williams, and he's going to get a first now following his lineman. Good play by him. First down 10. We're going to hand it back off again. He ain't going anywhere. Van Ersch is on top of him. 245 left. We hand it, he hands it back to Ricky. Shazier gets tripped up, and he gets down at the 48 for a first down. First and 15 because I don't know why he took a delayed game. Two-minute warning. You already see the user skills. Ryan Shazier on top of it. And pretty much that was the game ceiling pick. So, guys, honestly, we're just trying to run the clock out. I hope you guys, though, did enjoy this gameplay. As Saquon Barkley gets a nice run to end it. Again, I'll leave my brother's stuff in the description below. Shout out to him for helping me make my intro. So, I hope you guys, though, did enjoy. If you guys did, please just do me a favor. Leave a like. Subscribe if you are new. We're close to 100 subs. Follow me on Twitter. My link will be in the description below as well. Hope you guys have a great day. And I'm out.